Hey everyone, Gator Mom here. I have a review for you today on the brand new Jujube Be Classy bag. This is a new release that is coming out next week actually on Tuesday, but a few prints in this particular style have already been released. The Blooming Romance and the Space Place have both come out in this particular style already, but I have a first look for you guys today on this new Be Classy style in the Commodore print. This is a part of the Jujubee Legacy nautical line and it's stunning on this particular Be Classy. I'm absolutely in love with it. Those of you that have been watching my videos for a while know that I am a hardcore nautical lover. I absolutely love anchors. I love reds and blues and creams and whites. It's just kind of a color palette that I gravitate toward. I don't know, maybe living in Florida, I just feel like I can kind of rock this all year round, but it's always been a favorite of mine. And when I saw the Be Classy for the first time in person in this print, I absolutely fell in love. So I'm gonna be doing an actual packing video for you guys next week on this exact bag, but I wanted to just show you just a couple of angles of the bags, show you where the print placement is as far as where the first mate print is located versus the Admiral, and then give you guys a peek inside, just so for those of you that are on the fence about the Commodore versus some of the other prints, maybe this will um, help you in your decision making process. So the Be Classy here has this awesome structured mommy pocket on the front and this first mate print here on the Commodore is actually the only location in the whole bag besides a little bit over here on the side that has this first mate print. Everything else is Admiral and I love that because it just makes this print placement that much more special that it's only right here on the front. It's not on the back, it's not on the inside, none of those places. So I really like that about that. So you have your nice jujube plate here and then you have double zipper pulls and I will fold it down and show you guys the inside of this pocket. It's so pretty with that toasty gold lining. This is my favorite Jujube lining, I think, hands down. Out of all their bags, I absolutely love the nautical lining. It's light and it's like a toasty gold and it's just really pretty the way that it shimmers. But in here you have a nice zipper pocket, a really nice long um, key leash that I actually like to attach a small set piece in and put it right inside this front pocket. It's a great fit. Yep, baby's babbling in the background. And then you have another pocket here in the front and a nice, big, generous sunglass pocket. So it's an awesome mommy pocket overall for sure. Then on the back of the bag, I'll go ahead and turn it around and show you. You have a big zipper pocket and a really big felt lined um, tech pocket here, which is really good for cell phones and maybe small like iPods and things like that. But this pocket is really generous back here. It's very, very big. It holds the memory foam change pad that comes with this bag perfectly. So it's really, really nice that they've decided to add a zipper to this pocket. And and I like that it's just anchors back here and no first mate. It just, like I said, it adds something really special that the only spot of the first mate is in the front there of that bag. So you have these two tote straps on the Be Classy that are so classy. <laughs> I absolutely love them. I love the drop length. A lot of you had asked me if I felt like these straps are comfortable and I absolutely do. It fits so comfortable underneath my arm and I'll actually try to put some pictures at the end of this video if I can, um, kind of on the body shot for you guys. But the, the straps, like I said, are really, really comfortable. They're like a squishy foam almost and they fit really comfortably underneath my arm. The sides of the Be Classy are awesome. I love how they put the bottle pockets inside the bag. It's so streamlined here on the side that it just looks so stunning when you wear it on the body. The zippers are really, really easy to move up and down. And then you have a little peak of First Mate right there on the strap of the bag. So that's the only other spot here that has a little bit of the First Mate. But inside these side pockets, they have a nice, inside insulated bottle pocket so it's nice and thick it'll keep anything that you put in there warm or cool it's um, just a really really nice pocket I've been using it for tons of different stuff actually but I'm really liking that the bottle pockets like I said are inside the bag I think that it's great so then I'll give you a peek on the top of the bag here you have a big zipper that goes across the top and it can be 
opened up nice and wide, and then you have a good view there of the inside. You have two mesh pockets, another mesh pocket, a zipper pocket. It's pretty much structured similar to the Better Be. Those of you that have had this bag in the past will know um, kind of what the inside looks like, and I can link below reviews that I've done on the actual Better Be in the past, but it's structured very similar to that, but it's a little bit taller, so I like it even more. Then the bag also comes with the optional messenger strap, which is also in the Commodore. So it's mainly first mate here, and then your shoulder pad, which is a really, really nice padding, is the um, Admiral print. So I love it how they have these optional messenger straps because you can wear them with your B light bags or your Super Bs, bags like that that don't necessarily come with a messenger strap, but it has the option that you can put one there. So kind of saves you a step as far as having to buy a sold separately messenger strap. So that there is kind of the Be Classy in a nutshell. I mainly wanted to just get this video out because a lot of you were asking me about placement as far as where the anchors were located and the first mate. And then you, I also had a question regarding the bottom of the bag. The Be Classy does have four awesome feet down here at the bottom. So it's just a really nice overall bag. It's one of my favorites for sure for GGB. I thought that it was going to be much bigger in person. And then when I received it, I was pleasantly surprised that it is this size because I feel like I can wear it out as like a mommy bag or a purse. It would be awesome as a work bag. You could use it as a pump bag. So there's so many different things. It's just very, very classy the way that it's structured. So you can dress it up and dress it down. I cannot wait to get a black and white legacy print in this bag as well. I think that the Monarchs and the Queen of the Niles are going to be really stunning in this particular bag as well. So I hope this review um, was short and sweet and kind of gave you guys an idea, those of you that had been asking me about out the first mate and the admiral and stay tuned next week I'm gonna actually be doing a full-on packing video on this bag for you guys so you can see some different options on how you can pack up your be classy I will put in the description box below my affiliate link with Jujube. I would really appreciate it if you guys decide to shop Jujube that you shop through me so I can continue to make these great videos for you guys I appreciate you watching and I hope you guys have a fantastic rest of your week bye